one, the president's exactly right to go after China. He's the first president to really take him on head on. Uh, I think uh, a good, solid agreement with China uh, could actually set a, create a new era of fair trade with China, fair for our farmers, our workers, and our businesses. Um, you know, this is leverage uh, to keep everyone at the table. I mean, I'm hopeful that they can reach an agreement, a good, solid agreement, uh, and that these tariffs can be removed. Well, you know, as a, as a free trade advocate, you're never excited about any level of tar tariffs. But on the same hand, you got to use the tools that you have available to bring the others that are not playing by the same rules that we're expected to play by. You got to bring them to the table. And so while I hope this is short lived, very short lived, because it will have an impact on businesses, it'll have an impact on our economy, I think the president is making a right call to stand tough. It's taking people by surprise. They didn't expect it. Yesterday I was talking to uh, machinists. These are uh, the union, the people that work on bridges, and um, you know they were very concerned. Uh, fishermen, they were lobster fishermen, and they were worried about the impact of the tariffs on lobster. So I, I think we're going to see a ripple effect through our economy, and a lot of questions about what's the president's plan, what's what's the long-term impact. He makes his decisions in such a just precipitous way that we don't really have a sense of where he's headed with this.